Las Vegas investigation finds more weapons, but shooter's motive unknown. Day after the deadliest mass shooting in modern U.S. history, authorities are learning more about Stephen Paddock who fired into a crowd of thousands during a country music festival from a Las Vegas hotel room and the weapons he kept. At least 59 people were killed and 527 were injured. At least 59 people were killed and 527 were injured in the shooting that started late Sunday night. Police believe he killed himself, ending the massacre. Police searched the gunman's home in Mesquite, Nevada, where they found at least 19 firearms, explosives, several thousand rounds of ammunition and some electronic devices. In Paddock's 32nd floor hotel room at the Mandalay Bay Resort and Casino, Police recovered 23 weapons, including a handgun, and multiple rifles some had scopes on them. Authorities also found several pounds of ammonium nitrate, a material used to make explosives, in his car. As police uncovered more evidence, they're still piecing together a motive. There was no explanation so far on why Paddock, a 64-year-old retired accountant who had never faced any notable criminal charges, unleashed a hailstorm of bullets into concertgoers. So far, police believe Paddock acted alone. We believe Paddock is solely responsible for this heinous act, Clark County Assistant Sheriff Todd Fasulo said in a press conference late Monday.